Um, the first stage, the, the sprinters were denied. Uh, do you think that would be a different scenario today? I think there's a lot more motivation today. We've got a couple stages without a sprint, and I think everyone's antsy to kind of test out their lead outs and feel the legs for the sprint. So uh, we'll see today. Hopefully we can uh, keep the breakaway in check, and hopefully it'll be a good sprint. Uh, you were up there in the mix um, for the field sprint on day one, but you're sprinting for eighth. But I mean, what is the intensity a bit different from that, or is it how is the dynamic sprinting for when well, you're not sprinting for the win? Yeah, it takes a lot of the energy out of the sprint. I mean, we knew from 20k out that it wasn't going to be a sprint. The break had too much time, so really the you know the nervousness of the field died down. Um, but yeah, I mean it's still a sprint. We just still mess around, play with the lead out. But yeah, it's a lot, lot less intense, a lot less on the line. So it's, it's more just for fun than anything, not really so much pressure. And what's the, the dynamic? You also have Carlos Alzate as another fast man on the team. So what is the kind of dynamic between both of you? Yeah, we're trying, we're trying to get our roles sorted out for this year. He's a really strong rider and has a long sprint. So he's, he's fitting into a lead out role really well. We, we worked with him last year, obviously, in all the crits. And uh, he's, he's coming up a level. and. Uh, his speed is coming and his, his strength is there, so hopefully hopefully we can work together well and be up there in the mix. Um, I was here two years ago when you